Okay, Bryce. OAC football. Yeah. You pumped about it? I am. This is my first time uh, here, actually. Is it? Yeah. At, yeah, I, I've been in Wisconsin for seven years, and then this is my first time seeing it. I was at it once when it was like at three different places or whatever. Okay. But, and this is only my second time ever at Sports Force. It's amazing. Okay. So back from Wisconsin, right? Yes. All right. How long have you been back? Just over a year. Just over a year. Why does it feel good to be back in Ohio? Hello, Ohio, uh, yeah. You're in Oshkosh? Yes. So you're in Oshkosh on Lake Michigan? No, no. Uh, on Lake Winnebago, which is the biggest. Oh, okay, it's on Winnebago. Winnebago. Okay. All right. So when you look at, you know, coming back home, oh, first off, Midwest is the Midwest. Can we agree on that? Kind of, sort of. Kind of, sort of? Yeah, I think, I don't think, I think Ohio kind of has an identity crisis. Like, we don't know, are we East Coast or are we Midwest? We're, not, we're just confused. We're stuck in the middle. To, you go to Wisconsin, right, and people have that accent and stuff, and it's, it's a little bit different. It's, it's pretty cool, but Ohio's always been home, and I love it being here. Okay, you look at um, OAC, yeah. right? I keep talking talk to your dad about it, talk to Jared about it. 98-99, first season for it. Mm-hmm. And, and Jackson. The Jackson Athletic Complex. Uh, athletics, yes. Sports athletic Complex, 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 right? <laughs> so it's Jackson Middle School, but it's yeah. Sandusky's Middle School. Yeah. Um, you know, you were a little kid, right? Yeah, I would have been a freshman. You were, you, you, you were a little kid, yeah. right? Did you ever think that it would morph into and evolve into what it is? I think anyone that tells you that they thought it would evolve into what it is right now is lying to you. Um, I'm, I'm so glad it is, but I mean, when you talk about you're in a middle school, all right, and now you're filling a 6,000-person arena with 12 mats. Um, I think we were talking yesterday for you know, it's like 2,000 matches in junior high term. It's amazing. It's, it's amazing. And then you talk about this football tournament here and going from being at several different places to a state-of-the-art complex like this, it's, it's pretty awesome. Talking to your dad, it sounds like the 10 and under is going to be like where they're going to put some, some concentration and, and some resources into, and they're going to try and grow that division 10 and under. He, well, you know, the biggest thing he said was, uh, you know, 10 and under is kind of willy-nilly across the state. Yep. So it might have to be an earlier an earlier event, right? Mm-hmm. But the 12 and you, which is this, mm-hmm. is strong. Yes. Very strong, right? Yep. The, growth, the growth's here for this. Cheerleading's got growth. Track and field's got growth. Wrestling is bananas because Ohio's a hotbed, right? Yes. So that helps. But, um... You know, when you look at OEC, where do you see other areas where they're going to start concentrating? You know, besides, even if it's something I just mentioned, where do you see it besides wrestling? You know, uh, besides wrestling, I, I really don't know. I mean, you know, I'm not really privy to that. I know, you know, it, it's run by wrestling people, and that's why the wrestling is, is done so well. And now they're, you know, figuring out the strategic partners that you need to have to expand and grow this stuff. Um, I would love to see football really grow just because now you see – at least in our area here in Sandusky, there's a couple of teams. Or one team, St. Mary's, went down to eight-man team, uh, eight-man football. Yeah, I saw and then, that. And then Danbury, who darn near did the same thing. I think they might be doing that next year. Hundred eight-man teams is what I've heard. Yeah, I've heard is in the state I've, of Ohio. I've heard that, and there's no, there's no, you know, there's no rules for it. It's not sanctioned or anything like that. Um, I think that's the way that it's going to go. Uh, so I think that whoever can, maybe that's the next thing to do. Get a, get a, uh, get a head start on that. Um, and really and grow that. That's why I'm talking to you. You're a visionary. <laughs> yeah. You don't know, but you know, okay? Um, you're a wrestling junkie, though. Yes. I love right? It. Not as much as you, but yeah. I, I don't. That, that may not be an accurate statement, but um, when you look at wrestling, and you're obviously a Buckeye fan, right? Buckeye your, wrestling. Your coat would tell me that. Yeah, Buckeye you're, wrestling, yeah. All right, you're a Buckeye fan. Um, what do you make of all the madness in college wrestling right now? What do you it's, make of transfer portals? What do you make of uh, well, all the madness that's happening right now? Well, I just I was actually just talking about this with someone, and I think it's it's kind of ironic uh, that you know nowadays these kids are saying, "Hey, I'm going to the transfer portal," and then less than 24 hours later, they already know where they're going. Um, so there has to be some kind of conversations or things that are going on before that. No, no, no. They're just recruiting them and they're breaking all the rules. You, you're, you're, let's just call it what it is. Exactly. Right. Exactly. They just don't care about that. No. And, there, and here's the other thing: they had built relationships while they were recruiting b- them before they went and made their decision. So I think that's how a lot of this is happening anyway. Yeah. So maybe they aren't breaking the rules, but the relationship was existing from when they were recruiting them before. It definitely. Right? This is unprecedented, though. Right. Oh, well, yeah. I've never seen anything. Well, yeah. Like well, then they're going to start paying them in 2021. Yeah. And look what the NCAA just did with their best product. Mm-hmm. Right? Defensive end. Mm-hmm. For, for Ohio State, probably a Heisman Trophy winner. Probably. Yeah, right? But you know Chase what? Young. Yeah. Right? Well, I mean, they, they've taken away Heismans for 
things Reggie just like Reggie that Bush. Reggie Bush, the Bush push. I'll never yeah. forget that day. But yeah. um, it's it's insane. They got to get a handle on it because it's really it's bad for the sport. It's 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 bad. Bad for all of the sports, all of it. whether really they're bad. revenue or non-revenue. Yeah, right. It's just bad for. I mean, know, let the basketball players get paid, man. Hey, if if they get paid, if that means that I get uh, NCAA football back. Go for it. I want that back. I mean, it's coming back, I heard. I heard they're, I heard they're I, in the works. It? EA's in the works. I've just heard. I'm just telling you what I heard. Not making things up. Okay, social media. You're a big social media guy. Yeah. Like How, it. What has it evolved like? Because, you know, you, you got me into this. told me about clout, the thing where you could actually trace your, your digital footprint, mm-hmm. your social media footprint. And that's something. that That's five, six years ago, right? Yep. Now you look at it. Social media has completely evolved. It's, you know, people are, they are making a living. Oh yeah, definitely. off of being an Instagram model, definitely. Off of being or a YouTuber, yeah. w- whatever, right? Influencer, yeah. right? Effectively, I'm a I'm like a low level influencer, <laughs> right? Yeah. What's that been like, and what's what's it been like seeing social media evolve in the last you know five, seven, ten years? Well, first of all, I love it. I think it's it's the best way. It's the new grassroots marketing, right? If it's done well, right? Um, and I, if you were to ask me, you know, what I think, what, what I think is the next big thing is TikTok. Uh, TikTok's going to be huge, short form video. It's it's. It's gonna blow up. They already have the numbers. Um, Instagrams already in Facebook. Facebook owns Instagram. They're already talking about it and leaked memos from uh, Zuckerberg and everything like that um, about how they're gonna try to compete with that. Um, so anyone that's out there, that's what I would be getting into is looking at how you can use short form video. This is a little bit long, more long form, but that's where I would go. I will not be going there. I just want you to know that. I know right now I'm it's like an old dude, man. I know. I'm what? just I'm just not in. I know. I don't want to. I was a Vine man, man though. Yeah. I love the Vine. Dude. That was six seconds. Yeah. I got a bunch of saved vines on my phone. Yeah, just you download them all. No, I got them. Yeah, before they before they got rid of it. But okay. Um, if there's one thing I didn't mention here, you know what what, what is it, man? Because I always like sit down and talking to you. Yeah. Like a pick your brain, fill my brain with some knowledge. Let me know. Give me a scoop. Give me something, Bryce. Man, you're putting me on the spot here. And that's the point. I know. That, that's what interviews are. Yeah. Po- Do you yeah. use your defense soap? Uh, oh, defense soap and barbarian apparel. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. You just missed out on a t-shirt, by the way. Did I? Yeah. Maybe yeah. we'll just steal it from Crabtree and I'll give it to you. Oh, no, that's all right. He, 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 he won't even know the difference. I'll Trust see you. I'll see you. Trust me. He won't know the difference. I'll see you around. No, I'm, I, you know, I don't. I would just say uh, stay tuned. Uh, a lot, Zeb's going to be doing a lot more of these videos. I'm going to be doing some too. I'm stoked. This is the last OAC event before wrestling season starts, and I'm pretty much going to be every weekend that there's a tournament, I'm going to be somewhere in Ohio. Um, you know, being a rep or doing some of this where you're not, we're going to try to split our resources Perfect. and stuff. I'm so, in. Sign me up. Um, I'm excited. Where's your phone? Get your phone out. Let's go. All right. Let's go. Now, now is when you need to be taking oh, a picture. Yeah, I gotta... you, you always do this to me when you talk to me. Yep, there we go. Let's make it happen. (laughs) All right, thanks for the time. Let's go get you some soap. Keep grinding, all right? All right, thanks, man.